Hey guys, it's me again. Let's begin animate some flappy wings. Now, unless you're animating for a studio film or a AAA game whose main character is a bird, this little hack will work just fine. So bring in a camera with the wings image as a background. Add a plane, start roughly modeling around the image, press Ctrl R to make loop cuts and Shift V to move vertices along the edge. Add a subsurface modifier to smooth the edges, improve the mesh more if needed. I'm sure you guys are better at modeling than me, so your model will look much better than mine. Let's rig it! Add a bone, scale it down, align it to the mesh, head on over to edit mode and extrude along the skeleton. If you want to make a trial render, just use a plane and make a straight up rig to use as armature. When your armature is ready, head on over to pose mode and let the first bone be parent bone. Select the second bone and in the bone properties panel, animate the Z rotation, add a keyframe, move ahead a couple frames, add another keyframe in the negative Z value, move ahead a couple keyframes, add the first frame again. Select all the keyframes, press shift E, select make cycling. Now you have a flap cycle. Now select the third bone and in the bone constraint panel, add a copy rotation constraint. Change the target and owner to local space. Choose the armature as target and bone one as bone. In the bone data properties viewport display, set display as tick. This will give you a better visual. Now select all the other bones, control select the third bone, go to pose, constraint and copy constraint. Now all your bones rotate with the first one. You can reduce the influence value on your bones if you don't want your wings to bend a lot. If you want your wings to be damaged, do it before you add the armature, press K to add cuts, select the faces and delete them. Go back to object mode and in the rest pose, select your wings, control select your armature, press control P and parent with automatic weights. Now you have a basic wing animation. If you want to go all the way, add a cloth modifier, press play and your wing drops. Head back to the first frame, go to the weight paint mode, add a new vertex map and paint roughly around your bones. And in the cloth shape properties, choose the created vertex map as your pen group. Reduce the vertex mass of your cloth to something like 0.05, add a wind and turbulence force to add some flutter to your cloth, use the mirror modifier to make the other side and you're finally done. Special thanks to my current patrons for all the love and support. The project file for these animation have been on my Patreon for like a week along with tons of other project files. If you want, you could check it out and like the video, subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching. Until next time, goodbye.